Okay, Poketubers, I've got the mystery cloak of Japanese Pokemon Center store. And you all know what that means, so it's not really a mystery cloak anymore. But, uh, yep, got some stuff from Japan. Again. Um, so, ooh, unveiling. Still in its bubble wrap because, well, I was super excited to film this. So, um, let's get a better look, but I'm guessing that you can all probably guess what I've got under here. So, here we go. That looks to me like, I think this one's Dragon Blast. Yeah, Dragon Blast. Uh, booster box. And there's another Dragon Blast booster box. Um, then this would make this one Dragon Blade. Yeah, it's got Rayquaza on it. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Um, there we go. Sorry, my computer's just going berserk. So, and another Dragon Blade. That would make this one another Dragon Blast. And I'm guessing, like, just randomly that this would be another Dragon Blade. So, put that bubble wrap aside for later enjoyment. Um, <laughs> that sounded really gross. Um, but yeah, so, this is another freaking nuts episode of me opening six booster boxes of Japanese epicness of the new sets. So I'm thinking, I don't know which one I want to get started with. Oh, I don't know, I want to open first. Um, I think I'll go with Dragon Blast, which is the green one, I'm guessing, because I don't speak Japanese or read it for that matter. But I think green is Dragon Blast. So what have we got? We've got Durant and Apom. I like that monkey. I don't like the other monkeys. Hydreigon logo, Time Pole, Tim Pole, um, Hunch Crow, freaking Hydreigon and Giratina. I mean, just the new dragon type just is going to make this so exciting to like actually be getting dragon type Pokemon in a proper set, not in a promo set. This is it's exciting. Couldn't resist. There's going to be dragon type EXs, I'm guessing. Not guessing. I did look this up before I bought it. Um, yeah, Giratina EX is a dragon. Haven't seen any of the artwork, so I sort of wanted to keep it a surprise. So here we go. First Dragon Blast booster box. This is going to be epic. I'm so excited about this. So we've got Hydreigon and Giratina on the pack. It's just, just looks so epic. And I've learnt my lesson. I meant to do this. Yep. Thank you to everyone who commented that I was an idiot, basically. So we've got Mercury. I'll just make sure I'm this, I'm right and this is... Yeah, this is definitely Dragon Blast. Mercury. Vulpix. Rosalia. Palpitoad. And a Venomoth. Nice. Okay. This is super exciting. I love to get things from Japan. So I've had a pretty big week this week. I've had my 9 tin case to have open and hopefully I'll be able to upload now that the internet at my house is working again. So, alright. Got a Stunfisk. I'll focus so you can see the artwork better. Sorry guys. It's a weird artwork card, that one. Um, Aleron. Alomomola. Wow. I guess that's Waylord. Yeah, Waylord, that looks... That's a pretty awesome holo. The holo effect on these Japanese cards, I'm not sure if you can tell, but... It goes the whole way through the card. Like, it's got striations here as well, which is just epic. Really epic looking. And it goes all the way through the Pokemon. Then we've got a Claydol. Claydol's always weirded me out a little bit. Alright, we've got a Cascoon. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Cascoon. I get these the third gen mixed up the most, so this is fourth gen. But yes, Cascoon. Anyway, sorry. 
Um, Ordino, that's really cute artwork. <laughs> um, Buizel, Floatzel, and a Beautifly. It's cute artwork as well. Floatzel looked really good. I might have to send a Buizel to um, Poké Collection. He'll like that. I know he likes Buizel and Gyarados and stuff. So I don't even think Gyarados is in this set, no. It just seems odd that they haven't included Gyarados yet. It's like, come on, one of the first sort of dragon type, dragon looking cards. Alright, so we've got a Wurmple, a Bidoof, Mareep, oh my god, first EX. Oh wow, that's Mew EX right there. Oh wow. It looks so beautiful. What can I say? Then we've got a Drift Bloom. That is just an amazing card. See, they have this sort of all over holographic thing, whereas I don't know if I like the English or the Japanese versions better, but that just looks amazing. And Mew is super cute. So, yeah. I apologize if I go slow in this video, but I do really want to enjoy this. It costs me a lot of money to get these, so I really want to enjoy opening these packs. Alright, so we've got a Silcoon, a Welma. Aaron. Oh, what's this one? This trainer is Rescue Scarf. Cool. And Azuelus. Looks like he's like breakdancing or something. He does look weird. Anyway. So after I finish opening maybe half of this box, I'm going to take a break from opening because I've got to have lunch. I just got home from uni and I was like, ah, I have to open the packets. So this is exciting. Got the A form, same artwork as we saw on the box, which is cool. Um, Trubbish. Looks like it's vomiting, which that's kind of gross. Um, oh, yeah, that's definitely gross. <laughs> um, what's this one called? I always forget the name of this one. Oh dear, it's really sad. Baltoy. I wanted to say Baltoy, but um, I don't know. I didn't come out. Honch Crow, that's the artwork from the box as well. It looks really nice. Sort of cool. And then that's a beer barrel. So now that we've had like the new black and white series around for a while, I want to ask you guys what your favourite set is. Like, what your favourite series. So, like, for me, like, the most nostalgia is for, um, probably first gen, but... I do have a lot of love for um, second gen and also this new black and white gen because they're like the generations that I was involved with. So, yeah. Anyway, so we've got a uh, Drift Bloon. Drift Bloon, sorry. Durant. That looks it's good artwork of Durant. Oh, that's a really cute Dano. <gasps> I didn't even know Ampharos was in this set. Oh, I love Ampharos. That is an epic Ampharos as well. I'm s wow, that's gorgeous. And a Seismitoad. Nice. Oh wow, it's got two, three beautiful cards really, and I really like a lot of these, so um, wow, would you look at that Mui X, it's beautiful, well you can't see it, but I'm looking at it off to the sides now, so we've got Flaffy, it's weird, I don't like Marie or Flaffy, but I love that for us, Time Pole, Yanma, Sigalif, wow, that is a cool looking Sigalif, I'll give it that, and a Roserade. So maybe two more packs, and then I'm going to eat some noodles for lunch. Yay, noodles! It's not really anything special. It's just like noodles that come in a cup and you add hot water. So, yeah. <laughs> not that you guys get what I'm eating for lunch. Mercury. Really cute Vulpix. Fweasel. Claydol. Cool. What energy is that? Blend energy. Grass, fire, psychic, dark. Cool. I can get into that. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool looking energy. Look, look good in reverse anyway when it comes out in English. So these are all of course first edition. I've got a really good um, supplier on eBay. He's really nice. He, she, I'm not sure. Um, their username is Polly100. But um, I think it's like under Paper Moon Japan or something. But yeah, really reliable and trusted seller. Um, so there's Rosalia. Uh, Bidoof, Welmer, 
Whoa, EX. If Whoa, Terrakian EX. That looks awesome. Can't decide which one I like more. It's like jumping out of the card. I like this. It looks a lot like the Groudon one from Psycho Drive, which is amazing. Um, and then Ambipom, which is really cute as well. I like that. Well, I think I'll end the video on that note and have some lunch. So you guys probably won't notice the lunch break, so I'll hopefully upload these videos very quickly. And anyway, we got through half the box because I've opened 10 packs. I was just counting. So cool. See you guys next time.